Proper motion is the astronomical measure of the observed changes in the apparent places of stars or other celestial objects in the sky, as seen from the center of mass of the Solar System, compared to the abstract background of the more distant stars. The components for proper motion in the equatorial coordinate system of a given epoch, often J2000.0, are given in the direction of right ascension and of declination. And their combined value is computed as the total proper motion. It has dimensions of angle per time, typically arcseconds per year or milliarcseconds per year. Knowledge of the proper motion, distance, and radial velocity allows calculations of true stellar motion or velocity in space in respect to the Sun, and by coordinate transformation, the motion in respect to the Milky Way. Proper motion is not entirely proper. That is, intrinsic to the celestial body or star, because it includes a component due to the motion of the solar system itself. <laughs> Introduction Over the course of centuries, stars appear to maintain nearly fixed positions with respect to each other, so that they form the same constellations over historical time. Ursa Major or Crux, for example, looks nearly the same now as they did hundreds of years ago. However, precise long-term observations show that the constellations change shape, albeit very slowly, and that each star has an independent motion. This motion is caused by the movement of the stars relative to the Sun and Solar System. The Sun travels in a nearly circular orbit the solar circle about the center of the Milky Way at a speed of about 220 km per second at a radius of 8 kpc from the center, which can be taken as the rate of rotation of the Milky Way itself at this radius. The proper motion is a two-dimensional vector because it excludes the component in the direction of the line of sight and is thus defined by by two quantities, its position angle and its magnitude. The first quantity indicates the direction of the proper motion on the celestial sphere with zero degrees meaning the motion is due north, 90 degrees meaning the motion is due east, and so on, and the second quantity is the motion's magnitude typically expressed in arcseconds per year symbol arcsec per year, as per year or milliarcsecond per year, mass per year. Proper motion may alternatively be defined by the angular changes per year in the star's right ascension ma and declination, md using a constant epoch in defining these. The components of proper motion by convention are arrived at as follows. Suppose an object moves from coordinates alpha 1, delta 1 to coordinates alpha 2, delta 2 in a time delta t. The proper motions are given by mu alpha equals alpha 2 minus alpha 1 delta t display style mu underscore alpha equals frac alpha underscore 2 alpha underscore 1 delta t mu delta equals delta 2 minus delta 1 delta t display style mu underscore delta equals frac delta underscore 2 delta underscore 1 delta t the magnitude of the proper motion mu is given by the pythagorean theorem mu 2 equals mu 
delta 2 plus mu alpha 2 cos 2 delta Display style mu carrot two equals mu underscore delta carrot two plus mu underscore alpha carrot two C D O T cos carrot two delta mu two equals mu delta two plus mu alpha Two display style mu carrot two equals mu underscore delta carrot two plus mu underscore alpha ast carrot two, where delta is the declination. The factor in cos 2 delta accounts for the fact that the radius from the axis of the sphere to its surface varies as cos delta, becoming, for example, zero at the pole. Thus, the component of velocity parallel to the equator corresponding to a given angular change in alpha is smaller the further north the object's location. The change ma, which must be multiplied by cos delta to become a component of the proper motion, is sometimes called the proper motion in right ascension, and empty the proper motion in declination. If the proper motion in right ascension has been converted by cos delta, the result is designated ma asterisk. For example, the proper motion results in right ascension in the Hipparchos catalog hip have already been converted. Hence, the individual proper motions in right ascension and declination are made equivalent for straightforward calculations of various other stellar motions. The position angle theta is related to these components by mu sin theta equals mu alpha cos delta equals mu alpha Display style mu sin theta equals mu underscore alpha cos delta equals mu underscore alpha ast mu cos theta equals mu delta display style mu cos theta equals mu underscore delta Motions in equatorial coordinates can be converted to motions in galactic coordinates. Topic: Examples. For the majority of stars seen in the sky, the observed proper motions are usually small and unremarkable. Such stars are often either faint or are significantly distant, have changes of below 10 milliarcseconds per year, and do not appear to move appreciably over many millennia. A few do have significant motions, and are usually called high proper motion stars. Motions can also be in almost seemingly random directions. Two or more stars, double stars or open star clusters, which are moving in similar directions, exhibit so-called shared or common proper motion or CPM, suggesting they may be gravitationally attached or share similar motion in space. Barnard's star has the largest proper motion of all stars, moving at 10.3 seconds of arc per year. Large proper motion is usually a strong indication that a star is relatively close to the Sun. This is indeed the case for Barnard's star, located at a distance of about six light years. After the Sun and the Alpha Centauri system, it is the nearest known star to Earth. 
because it is a red dwarf with an apparent magnitude of 9.54, it is too faint to see without a telescope or powerful binoculars. A proper motion of one arcsec per year at a distance of one light year corresponds to a relative transverse speed of 1.45 km per second. Barnard star's transverse speed is 90 km per second and its radial velocity is 111 km per second which is at right angles to the transverse velocity, which gives a true motion of 142 km per second. True or absolute motion is more difficult to measure than the proper motion, because the true transverse velocity involves the product of the proper motion times the distance. As shown by this formula, true velocity measurements depend on distance measurements, which are difficult in general. In 1992, Rho Aquilae became the first star to have its Bayer designation invalidated by moving to a neighboring constellation, it is now a star of the constellation Delphinus. <laughs> Usefulness in astronomy Stars with large proper motions tend to be nearby, most stars are far enough away that their proper motions are very small, on the order of a few thousandths of an arcsecond per year. It is possible to construct nearly complete samples of high proper motion stars by comparing photographic sky survey images taken many years apart. The Palomar Sky Survey is one source of such images. In the past, searches for high proper motion objects were undertaken using blink comparators to examine the images by eye, but modern efforts use techniques such as image differencing to automatically search through digitized image data. Because the selection biases of the resulting high proper motion samples are well understood and well quantified, it is possible to use them to construct an unbiased census of the nearby stellar population—how many stars exist of each true brightness, for example. Studies of this kind show that the local population of stars consists largely of intrinsically faint, inconspicuous stars such as red dwarfs. Measurement of the proper motions of a large sample of stars in a distant stellar system, like a globular cluster, can be used to compute the cluster's total mass via the Leonard Merritt Mass Estimator. Coupled with measurements of the star's radial velocities, proper motions can be used to compute the distance to the cluster. Stellar proper motions have been used to infer the presence of a supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way. This black hole is suspected to be SGRA asterisk, with a mass of 4.2 times 106 m, where m is the solar mass. Proper motions of the galaxies in the local group are discussed in detail in Roser. In 2005, the first measurement was made of the proper motion of the Triangulum Galaxy M33, the third largest and only ordinary spiral galaxy in the local group, located 0.860 plus or minus 0.028 MPC beyond the Milky Way. The motion of the Andromeda Galaxy was measured in 2012, and an Andromeda–Milky Way collision is predicted in about 4 billion years. Proper motion of the NGC 4258 M106 galaxy in the M106 group of galaxies was used in 1999 to find an accurate distance to this object. 
Measurements were made of the radial motion of objects in that galaxy moving directly toward and away from us, and assuming this same motion to apply to objects with only a proper motion, the observed proper motion predicts a distance to the galaxy of 7.2 plus or minus 0.5 mpc. Topic. History Proper motion was suspected by early astronomers according to Macrobius, AD 400 but a proof was not provided until 1718 by Edmund Halley, who noticed that Sirius, Arcturus and Aldebaran were over half a degree away from the positions charted by the ancient Greek astronomer Hipparchus roughly 1850 years earlier, the term, proper motion derives from the historical use of «proper» to mean «belonging to» cf. propre in French and the common English word property «improper motion» would refer to «motion» common to all stars, such as due to axial precession. Stars with high proper motion The following are the stars with highest proper motion from the Hipparchos catalogue. It does not include stars such as Teagarden's star, which are too faint for that catalogue. A more complete list of stellar objects can be made by doing a criteria query at the Simbad Astronomical Database. Topic Software There are a number of software products that allow a person to view the proper motion of stars over differing time scales. Free ones include Hipliner Windows, moderately sophisticated with some pretty displays. Still under development, needs some more navigation and configuration features. Zephim Linux and macOS, complete astrometry package, can view a region of the sky, set a time step, and watch stars move over time. Proper Motion Simulator website, runs in browser. Watch the positions of stars change with time and fly through constellations to get a sense of their volume. See also Celestial coordinate system Galaxy rotation curve Leonard Merritt mass estimator Milky Way Peculiar velocity Radial velocity Relative velocity Solar apex Space velocity astronomy very long baseline interferometry